Hey guys, this time I'm going to show you how to fill and charge a new lead acid battery. My wife's CBR battery was dead and couldn't hold a charge, so it needed to be replaced. None of my local retailers sold the battery size needed for the CBR 300, so we ordered it off of Amazon. Due to shipping safety regulations, they ship the battery dry and it's up to you to fill it with acid. This might seem pretty intimidating, but it's actually fairly easy. Here's how to do it. Start with a clean and clear workspace and wear appropriate gloves and eye protection. Battery acid is no joke. It will cause serious chemical burns in a hurry. So take every reasonable precaution to stay safe. The battery that I ordered came with a pre-measured quantity of acid in six adjacent cylinders with a foil seal over each. So all I had to do was turn it upside down and puncture all six seals at once on the fill spouts for the six individual battery cells. We let it sit in this position for an hour or so to allow the acid to fully drain into the battery and also to allow any bubbles to get out. The chemical reaction between the lead plates and the sulfuric acid is exothermic so the battery got pretty warm as soon as it was full of acid and I didn't want to pump electricity into a hot battery. So after we waited until the next day to allow the battery to cool off, I connected it to a trickle charger and waited for about a day. And bam, brand new battery ready to install. Easy peasy. That's it for this time. Thanks for watching.